Hey guys and welcome to this week's uh, Stack in the Shelves. Um, we haven't done one for the past two weeks and the um, thing is we have filmed one before a couple of days ago but the problem is um, the video won't upload or it won't get removed from the iPad or something and my sister's too busy to do um, another uh, video right now so I'll just be doing it on my own. Um, we have a ton of books. Um, the, these We got a ton of books these past two weeks so I'm just gonna like go through all of them really quickly and if you guys have any questions or any comments about any of those books just put them in the comments below or whatever and um, I'll be sure to look at them and reply back or whatever. So um, I'm just gonna start off with the review books that we got for the past two weeks and the first book is, or audiobook actually, is from Macmillan Audio and it is Monsters Beauty by Elizabeth Fama. I got this book a couple of days ago. I started it yesterday and I'm actually more than halfway through. It's really interesting. And I find that this kind of book is the type of book that you would enjoy more listening to it than actually reading it. Um, we also got books from Harlequin Teen and the first one is The Goddess Inheritance by Amy Carter. Um, Amy Carter. This is the third and last book in the Goddesses trilogy. We also got Ink by Amanda Sun. This is um, uh, paranormal with like Japanese elements. Uh, also the much anticipated uh, second installment of the uh, Blood of Eden trilogy, I think. The Eternity Cure by Julie Kagawa. This is like the book that my sister is dying to read, like her most anticipated book right now. Uh, also we got some books from Penguin and the first one is White Lines and it is by Jennifer Benash. We also got Imposter by Suzanne Winokur. A book that I've been dying to read and it is The Moon and More by Sarah Dessen. And lastly, um, Star Curse by Jessica Spotswood. I actually just read uh, Born Wicked a couple of weeks ago, I think two weeks ago. So um, I'm really excited to pick this one up. So if you guys have been checking out our blog, you would have known that we went to a bookish event um, two weeks ago, two Sundays ago. And um, we got a ton of books from this event. The first are some books that um, we swapped with some Canadian bloggers and also books that they just gave away and wanted to give to a good home. So some of these books include Eve by Anna Carey, The Lost Prince by Julie Kagawa, sorry, Speechless by Hannah Harrington, Sever by Lauren DeStefano, and Fever by Lauren Stefano. Pretty Tough by Liz Teglar. And Head Games by Carrie Mikulski. These, these companion novels or whatever you call them, um, I've actually been looking for them everywhere and uh, I'm so glad that Tiff had them and she gave, she generously gave them away for me, to me. Um, we also got, um, Boys, Bears, and a, seri a Serious Pair of Hiking Boots by Abby MacDonald. Uh, LA Candy by Lauren Conrad, and I actually read this series and I really enjoyed it. Um, my sister wants to read them. And lastly, um, Just Listen by Sarah Dessen. Yeah, those are a ton of books that we got from these Canadian bloggers, so thank you for everyone. Ashley, um, Michelle, um, Tiff, and Omar. Thank you so much. Now we also got two books from the give uh, from the uh, event from in the goodie bags, and they are Once Every um, Never by Leslie Livingston. We got two copies, one for me, one for my sister. So be sure um, be on the lookout for a giveaway for a copy. Now I was lucky enough to actually win um, some books in the event, and they are all Razor Bill. Um, actually, they're all Penguin titles, and I was so excited for all of them because some of these books are actually books that I've been dying to read. One I've already read, and it is Legend by Mary Lou. Paper Valentine by Brenna Yovanoff. We already have an arc, so we'll be giving away that arc, so be sure, be on the lookout for that. Origin by Jessica Hoodie, and oh my god, thank god this was part of the price pack because I've been dying to read this book, and I love dystopian novels, so I'm really excited for this one. Another awesome dystopian that I'm dying to read is Black City by Elizabeth Richards. And the last, books is, the last book is The Innocence by Lily Peliquin. Awesome book. So these are all the books. And the only book that's left is a library book that my sister got and actually read. And it is Finale by uh, Becca Fitzpatrick, the last book in this uh, Hush Hush saga. 
So these are all the books. Be sure to link below, comment, subscribe if you guys could subscribe. And um, that's it. Have a nice week, guys. Bye.